Donald's a young man out of Columbus, Ohio, that we uh, watched play as a as a 16 year old, and he piqued our interest early. Um, has played for the Ohio Blue Jackets AAA program the, for for a long time now, and uh, he's a he's a big, strong defenseman that can really skate. Uh, he's currently playing in Chicago uh, for the Chicago Steel and coach Scott McDonald or McConnell in the, in the USHL, and, and he's a kid that we think has a, a really big upside, has a lot of potential. Right-handed kid that can play in every situation for us. We expect him to come in and compete for a lot of minutes right away. Uh, comes from a real good family. Uh, is, is a worker. He was a multiple sport athlete in high school, and, and now he's focused on on hockey only now uh, in, in his senior year there in Chicago. So we're real excited about him. He's got really good feet. Plays with some some bites. Been in a couple fights now, and and uh, so has a, has a, has that side of his game. But there's, there again, he's, he's a kid that we see coming in here as a, as a defenseman and being able to play uh, in, in all areas, you know, five on five, power play, penalty kill, and, and we think his, his potential and upside is, is through the roof. So we're really excited about Connor. Yeah, well, obviously everybody knows that the USHL is an outstanding league. There's, there's no doubt. I mean, if you go ahead and look on their um, the USHL website, you can see every team in that league's got a bunch of kids committed to, to play Division One college hockey. So it's an outstanding league, and it'll be really good for Connor to go there. And you know, coming from midget major hockey to going to the USHL, that's a big jump. And so for him, he's he's playing against older guys, bigger, stronger guys right now, which uh, I think the thing that's most exciting for us is he'll go there and, and, and play for a couple of years, and then when he gets to Bowling Green, he's going to have played a lot of games against big, strong hockey players, and, and that should allow his transition to college hockey be uh, a little more smooth.